Thank you very much, Julia. Since this is a bilingual school, we uh, are proud to teach our students how to do everything in at least two languages, whether it's ping pong or math. So please welcome our English-speaking uh, teacher, Jeff Francois, who is new this year. team in the fall of this academic year and we're really happy and proud that he is with us. Thank you. I am delighted to be here with you. As I thought about what connects us, you students, and me. A series of questions came to mind. The first being, is it because we've both been educated in French and English? Is it because we've both traveled, if not lived, in many places? Or is it because we both share a not-so-secret love of music <laughs> and fun? Yes. Then I thought about the various works we've read this year, books about identity and love, books about survival, books about transformation. Next, I thought about the experiences we've shared in and out of the classroom. It may have been something as elaborate as discussing a piece of poetry, or something as simple as exchanging a simple smile. By making myself open to you, I've learned not only about Kid Cudi <laughs> and Taylor Swift, but I believe I've learned something of your pain and courage, humor and creativity, dreams, and aspirations. Now, as for a few pearls of wisdom to leave you with, I have a couple to offer. It's not about your aptitude. It's about your attitude. All the greatness and limitations of humanity are yours. So, go out and strive for greatness. It's in all of you. Every single one of you. <laughs> because you should aim for nothing less. Now, Connor, it's hammer time. <laughs> why the kids can stay seven hours in a row listening to them, they're fascinating. And they're funny too. So, as we all know, teachers are important in school. Uh, however, the most important thing, if I may say that, in a school is, well, the students, of course. So, please join me in welcoming our, the president of our student council, uh, Talula Axian.
<rire> Hi, bonjour. Um, euh, quatrième et finalement fini. Euh, nous avons fait beaucoup ensemble ces trois dernières années et nous n'oublierons jamais. We began sixth grade as the smallest. We went to school dances and Walgreens after school. In seventh grade, we said goodbye to two 30 dismissals and an easy workload and welcomed not that much. We went to Yosemite and that's all the excitement for seventh grade. And then there's eighth grade. We're the oldest and we definitely use that to our advantage. In February, we went to Paris. It was such a cultural trip and we did so many things. One day though, we were at the Musée Carnaval and we were told not to sit down. So as Mr. Manick and Mr. Payton enjoyed the works of art, we all took turns sitting down and being on the lookout if they happened to walk by. <laughs> <laughs> then it was April, and most of us left for a third language trip. In Guatemala, we ate amazing food. Guacamole, Clara. <laughs> Tortillas, chips, and of course, pollo con pero. <laughs> The Chinese class had a little <coughs> trouble when they got lost in the streets of Taipei. And the Italian class got to know Florence a little better when they were stuck there for an extra week. <laughs> and I don't think any of us will forget the memories we've had with teachers. In sixth grade, having conversations with Mrs. Howe about the worst ways to die, <laughs> <laughs> learning about being a cowboy in school <laughs> at UCLA and Cal with Mr. Harder. <laughs> Spanish class with Senor Paz, where all we did was tell Tiger Woods jokes. <laughs> <laughs> Although we've had some fun times with teachers, we've also lost a couple this year, Mr. Ranger and Claire Fidal. Today we graduate from middle school and we'll never have our phones taken away by Pierre, <laughs> play dodgeball, German football, <laughs> or soccer as a grade or even eat lunch in NPR 4. We finished middle school and we're going to high school. <coughs> These three years have been interesting and we're not likely to forget them. So congratulations, class of 2010. Thank you, Jalula, and get well soon. Um, good luck at International. As a, the, the great student and the smiling leader that you are, you're off to a great start in high school and to even greater things later on. <laughs>